What is going on guys? Welcome to Greg Olson's TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day. We've got two stories for you and they're really good. So let's just dive right in. Our first story of the day has to do with the amount of updates most phones get compared to the Google Pixel 7, or Pixel 8 phones, I should say. Because if you remember yesterday, we talked about the Google Pixel 8 phones getting seven years of OS and security updates, which is insane. But what about other phones and how they compare? Well, here's a list that Yogesh Brar has put together showing that Google stands high and tall above everyone else, two years more than Apple. Apple does five years of OS updates, and they do do more years of security updates, but crazy. Samsung at five years and four OS updates. OnePlus at uh, five years and four OS updates. Xiaomi, five years, four OS updates. Vivo, three years, two OS, two OS updates. Three years and two OS, two OS updates for uh, nothing. Motorola, three years, two OS updates. And then he has some slight corrections that nothing has a four year update policy, which isn't bad. Um, Apple standard, like I mentioned, is a five year with beyond that for security updates and that the five year update notice for Xiaomi started with the 13T series. Budget devices still have a two plus three update. So it's pretty crazy that you can get that many years of updates. I just don't know, like obviously the percentage of people that keep their phone for like seven years is probably extremely low. I think five years is probably a really good sweet spot. But um, do you keep your phone for seven years? Let me know in the comments down below. Our last story of the day has to do with the release of the Galaxy S24 phones. It seems like we're getting more strong information about when this is going to be launched and released. So here it goes. So this information is ultimately coming from Ice Universe, but our guy Vegnas is saying that S24 to launch on January 18th. Now, when we look at a little calendar entry, you can see the 18th is a Thursday, meaning that the 19th would be a Friday. And the reason I say that is because two weeks later, which would be February 2nd, is usually when they release their phones. They usually launch them on like a Wednesday or so or Thursday, and then they end up releasing the phone on a Friday, which is usually two weeks after the event. So that's why I'm saying February 2nd, which if that comes into play, you're looking at these phones being in your hand, most likely in January, because they usually ship out the phones four days usually earlier than the actual release date, three to four days earlier. So you're looking at the very end of January as the actual in-hand feeling of that phone, which is, uh, seriously right around the corner and it's also earlier than expected you know in terms of when we get these usually get these like mid february late february somewhere in that time frame this time it's looking like it's going to happen in terms of actual release date probably february 2nd but actual in hand end of january are you guys pre-ordering this phone let us know in the comments down below you're just like nah i'm not gonna do it i'm happy with what i got let us know thanks for watching have a great day and we'll see you down the road peace